So let's review the heart anatomy. We are going to start from the anterior side of the patient. So as if we're looking from the looking at the patient and they're facing us. This is a superior aspect, so towards the head, and the inferior aspect towards the feet. This is the patient's left, and this is the patient's right. And starting at the superior side, we're looking at the SVC coming down into the right atrium. And uh, this is the right atrium here. And then you'd be going through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle. From the right ventricle into the pulmonary valve here, going out to the pulmonary arteries. Remember, arteries take blood away from the heart. So even though this is a deoxygenated blood, this is the one place in the body where you have deoxygenated blood running in the arteries. So this is a pulmonary trunk, and the left pulmonary artery and the right pulmonary artery traveling behind SVC there. And then you have um, the blood going out into the lungs here on either side. And then coming back to the heart through the pulmonary veins. Again, this is one time when you have oxygenated blood running in the veins. And you have the left superior and inferior pulmonary vein and the right superior and inferior pulmonary vein. And then they come back to the heart into the left atrium. From the left atrium, you would go through the bicuspid or mitral valve into the left ventricle. From the left ventricle, it pumps blood through the um, aortic valve here, right just behind the pulmonary valve, and it would go through the aorta. And here's the aortic arch here. So you have the ascending aorta, the aortic arch, the descending aorta. And coming off the aorta, you would have the, the brachiocephalic artery and the left common carotid and the left subclavian here. So I'm going to just turn that just a little bit. Again, coming off the aortic arch, you have the brachiocephalic artery and the left common carotid artery and the left subclavian artery. So those are the three branches off the aortic arch. And this is a little bit different view of the pulmonary trunk going into the pulmonary arteries and then the pulmonary veins. And I'm going to just spin this all the way around here so you can see this from a posterior view. And you can see how the, I didn't show you the, uh, inferior vena cava before, but you can see that SVC here, the superior vena cava, and the inferior vena cava, and they both meet up in the uh, right atrium, which is just anterior of the right pulmonary uh, veins. And then you can see how the aortic arch comes across from right to left as it goes anterior to posterior. And then you can also see how the pulmonary arteries branch uh, right and left, just posterior to the SVC. So that gives you another view of it. So now I'm just going to turn this back anteriorly. Okay, so here we are again at the anterior view. I'm just going to slide this cursor in so we can see the valves a little bit better. So again, you have deoxygenated blood coming through the SVC and the IVC, inferior vena cava, superior vena cava, coming into the right atrium, going through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle, going through the pulmonary valve right here into the pulmonary arteries, the left and the right pulmonary arteries, and then going into the lungs on each side coming back through the superior and inferior left pulmonary vein and the superior and inferior right pulmonary vein, coming back into the left atrium, going through the uh, bicuspid or mitral valve into the left ventricle, and then going from there, I'm just going to turn this just a little bit. Yep, there you go. So now you can see the aortic valve going up through the ascending aorta, the aortic arch and the descending aorta. And on its way um, through the aortic arch, you're going to be going into the brachiocephalic artery, the left common carotid, carotid artery, and the left subclavian artery here. So I would really love some feedback on these um, lectures uh, through virtual reality, uh, letting me know if you think this is beneficial for you at all. Um, I'm going to try to get a couple more out to you this quarter. Um, but let me know what you think. Thanks so much.